Without further ado and right on time, please let me welcome to the stage the Walter Day Lifetime Achievement Award winner, class of 2021 for the International Video Game Hall of Fame, Gary Stern. It's all mine. I mean, I, boy, I'm at a loss for words because I hadn't low prepared anything. This is, you know, it's it's quite an honor because you all know that uh, we've concentrated for decades on pinball machines. We did some video games in our day. Um, we did a lot of Konami games, but we also created a bunch of games that uh, you guys would remember better than than I do. Uh, but. You know, the, prin the principal rem uh, remembered ones are Berserk and Frenzy, which were similar games. I had a, I had a, uh, a big boat once, and its name was Evil Otto, because that's who paid for that boat. And for those of you who don't know, Evil Otto was the bouncing ball. It was a maze game, and he's the one that would, that killed you uh, <laughs> and got you. So, um, those were, when most of the games were coming out of Japan, the coin-op games, um, those were games that were developed here. Um, we did a lot of other games. Uh, uh, again, a lot of, a lot of uh, Konami games. We brought Konami into America, but we also developed a lot of games with, uh, oh, God. You know, this is a long time ago, guys. This is 40, 41 years ago I was doing doing. Those, those games, 41, you know, f between uh, um, 35 and 40, 41 years ago. Um, and we, we had a, a 3D game that we did. Uh, we had, um, Jesus, and we did some games that were just, oh, you probably have more stuff up there about me than I know about me. Uh, but uh, it was, um, it was part of the, you know, it was an important part. And you know that um, the video games in those days we were coin up. It was not as much home game. Um, we video games. You, you may not. You, you may not think of this, or think I'm, you may think I'm nuts. But they were the first introduction of us all between um, the monitor, the computer, the monitor. And us, yeah, the colleges had computers. When I was in college, we had to do a program where you typed the cards and all that, and it, was, it never worked. Uh, you know, and you, you fed the cards through. But the real thing that made is it started making us comfortable with our computers, I think, was video games. And what these guys in the early years created, which brought us all into, uh, into being comfortable uh, with our computers and uh, and where we are today, yeah, we got video games on computers. We got everything else, including Facebook on computers. Just good and bad sides, everything. Uh, but um, it, I think it was, you know, we were principally a pinball company, but uh, always. But the, the, we we did the video, and I think it was a very part of, important part of the introduction, both of man and the monitor, and also of the technology. Uh, when we switch from. Uh, Okay, the video games made with discrete chips to microprocessors and so forth. So um, I'm very honored to, to be recognized. I don't think I'm the most important person in video games, but I think that all of us in those days, what we did, contributed to it. So I appreciate you honoring me, and I thank you all very, very much. I'm going to read the plaque off to you. Walter Day Lifetime Achievement Award. This award honors individuals that have served the electronic gaming industry over the course of a long career, enriching the industry with their contributions, strong leadership, and creative vision. In 2021, Gary, that is you. Gary Stern, 2021. Thank you so much. May I present this to you? Thank you very much. I appreciate it, everybody. 